Okay. Well, good morning, everyone. Uh, my name is uh, Wes Carrier. I'm the commander of VFW Post 4092 on St. Simons Island. And we're here for a very special occasion this morning at Glenn Middle School. And uh, we are awarding a uh, Patriots Pen Youth SA Competition uh, Certificate of Merit and um, to a, a stellar young author, uh, one of 130 people competing, but only one of three who were selected to receive an award uh, and have the potential for moving up. So, but let me explain that a little bit by telling you a little bit about the Patriots Pen program uh, sponsored by the VFW. Uh, the essay competition gives six, it, the Patriots Pen gives uh, six, seventh, and eighth grade students the opportunity to uh, examine American history uh, along with their own uh, experience in American society by writing a 300 to a 400 word essay expressing their opinion on a patriotic theme that is selected each year by the VFW Commander-in-Chief. This year's theme is What Makes America Great? From the uh, 130 uh, participants, as I said, from three schools in Glynn County, uh, Glenn Middle, Frederica Academy, and St. Simon's Christian School participated. And from that 130, three students were selected as first, second, and third place winners. Uh, that enables them to advance to the next level of competition at the regional or district level. The winners at the district level will then advance to the department or the state level. Each first place winner at the state level uh, then competes for a total of $55,000 in award money at that level, with first place national winner receiving a $5,000 scholarship and an all expense paid trip to Washington, D.C. Each state winner will receive at least $500 at the national level. Today, on behalf of St. Simon's VFW Post 4092, I am privileged and proud to recognize one of your classmates at Glenn Middle for excellence in the Patriots Pen Youth Essay Competition. Evan O. Graham, second place in the competition. By presenting you with this certificate of merit designating you an outstanding young spokesperson of the future by St. Simon's VFW Post 4092. In addition, I am pleased to award you this check for $100 as a second place prize. Congratulations. Thank you. Would you like to read your essay? Sure. <laughs> There are many countries in the world, but one stands over all the rest. And that country, you may be asking, is America. All of, overall, America is a, or overall, America is a great country. Some, thing, some things that make it a great country are all, or that it accepts all countries and races. All, it also has free education. Don't forget that the citizens of America have more freedoms than people in other countries do. The USA accepts all cultures, religions, and races. We have Christians, Muslims, atheists, etc. And we accept many races as well. African Americans, Mexicans, Asians, etc. Name the race or culture and we probably have it. Heck, you could probably be, wa you could be walking on the sidewalk in a big city and see so many races and cultures everywhere. Something else that's great about the US has that we have free education. It is sometimes hard to find free education in any other country. You might be wondering about how we have free education and how we might, or how we have money for things like computers, paper, and other things. Well, first of all, we pay taxes, and those taxes go to the government. And then the government splits the money up, gives the money to, to the school to buy food, computers, books, and other things that, that are needed. But sure, private schools sometimes have better teachers and such, but public schools are around $10,000 cheaper than private school. So it is kind of worth it to go to a public school. One of the most important reasons that America, 
that makes America great is that an American citizen has more freedoms than any other than any other people in the in other countries do, such as the freedom of speech, religion, press, assembly, etc. These freedoms make it where people in America can follow any religion they want, or they can basically do what anything they want except for kill people, rob banks, and do any crimes. Also, don't forget that America has many laws in place to keep in or keep order in the country. Overall, America is a great country. It accepts it accepts all races and cultures. It has a free education, and don't forget that a citizen of America has a lot of freedoms. If you have the time to come visit America, it would I would do it because it is it would hopefully be a great experience for you. Very good. Thank you. Congratulations. And thank you so much for your participation in this uh, program. And we invite you to uh, participate in the Voice of Democracy competition next year, being the eighth grader you are now. Uh, the Vo Voice of Democracy competition provides high school freshmen, sophomore, juniors, and seniors the opportunity to write and record an audio essay on a patriotic theme competing for more than $2.1 million in college scholarships and incentives. Each first place department, that's at the state, each first place state winner is brought to Washington, D.C. in February to enjoy our nation's capital and compete for a total of $155,000 in national college scholarships. First place receiving $30,000. Each state winner will receive at least $1,000 uh, at that national level. Again, congratulations and best wishes to you. Thank you. Evan, it's a pleasure. Thank you. We're very proud. And thank you for a sponsoring teacher. Thank you, thank you so much. Yes, sir. Thank you.